guess uh, for, first off, Sugar Rogers is, is obviously a pretty big part of their team. What, what do you what do you, have, you guys have to do to sort of shut her down? Well, we can't let her get a lot of touches. You know, we got to stay out on her and limit her touches. And needless to say, uh, you know, she's going to look for a lot of shots. And you know, I think if we uh, we got to be aware of where she's at at all times uh, on transition defense and along with uh, within their offense. I think you mentioned in the past years they kind of like to turn the game almost ugly if they can. Yeah. Is that kind of? Yeah, insane? they press a lot. They'll press for 40 minutes out of different looks. Um, and they're very aggressive, very athletic, and, uh, you know, they get a lot of their offense off their defense by getting, uh, you know, other teams to turn it over and that type of stuff. So it's going to be very important we take care of the ball against their pressure. Because, you know, if you lose the ball in a full court trap, it's usually a layup on the other end. Obviously, take every game one game at a time, but is this a week that you kind of had marked as an important week? Two ranked teams on the road. Yeah, um, you know this is you know anytime you wait to play away from the call team, it's tough. But you're playing two quality teams. You know they're both ranked. They're both very deep. Both very athletic and, and can score a lot of points. So you know we realize that we have to play extremely well. Uh, defensively and offense, you know, we're going to score some points. And we're not going to hold them down like we do some of these other teams. So we're going to have to offensively be efficient also. Between Sarah and Medina and Maurice, you dealt with some, some adversity and obviously did it well in the beginning part of the season. What was the key to, to overcoming that kind of adversity with two of your key starters and also moving forward now? Well, you know, you know, everybody in the country is probably banged up at this time of year. Not unique to anybody, uh, so you know that's one of the reasons why you know we think we have developed some people off the bench, and they're going to, have to pick up. You know we need some other players to pick up. Uh, you know do a little bit more for this basketball team what they have been doing, and, and, and there's no doubt in my mind Medina will leave. I mean she, she's going to give us everything she has. So you know I'm not counting Medina out. She'll continue to play hard. Continue. I just don't know how many minutes she's going to be able to play at this time. Oh. Week in, week out. Yeah, you know, uh, latest update on, on how she is or what? Well, it was very sore yesterday. Uh, we didn't practice her. Today we probably won't practice her very much, but she will play on Tuesday. So, you know, it's going to be one of those things that, uh, you know, I think she, you know, it's like pro players sometimes. You know, they don't practice a lot, but they play on, on Sundays. So, you know, she's just going to, but she's a tough kid. So I think, uh, you know, if anybody can get through this, she can.